As 2020 comes to an end, so does my subscription to Construct Free. Welcome back to the channel. We are up to devlog number three. In this video, I am going to make the decision whether or not to keep working in Construct 3 or move to another engine. Every year at the end of December, I have to make the decision to pay for another year of Construct 3 or to leave it behind and commit to another engine. In the past couple of years, the decision seemed easy. I had several projects in the works, just like I do now, and I had every intention of finishing them. Therefore, the idea of renewing my Construct 3 subscription made practical sense. The difference between then and now is that I have been working in another engine for the last few months. More on that in a minute. I'll tell you the whole story of how I got started in game development in an upcoming devlog video. For now, I just want to say how awesome this game engine has been and I highly recommend it to anyone of any skill level and any age as a means to get started in game development. However, it's not as powerful as some of the other options out there and I'm reaching a point where I need that extra power to create the ideas I have going on in my head. So here we are. My license expires in a few days and I have been trying to make this decision to keep it or not for about two months now. So here's what's going to happen. The game engine I've been working in recently is the Dark. I will explain more of why I went with this engine in a future video, but for now I want to explain what this means for the future of this channel. As for Construct 3, I have made the decision to continue working with it for at least one more subscription year, but new plans for the content of this channel are coming. I won't go into too much detail as I am still trying to get that sorted out. Okay, did I make that dramatic enough? But what I can tell you right now is, yes, there will be more Construct 3 tutorials, and yes, there will be a couple of Godot tutorials coming in 2021. At the end of 2021, I will reevaluate the situation and make this dramatic decision again. I'm joking. It's not that big of a deal. But I know many of you are here for the Construct 3 tutorials, and I do enjoy making projects in Construct 3. But eventually, we all have to move on, and that time for me is approaching. But hopefully, you'll all be able to come on the Godot experience with me, and we'll keep making games. As I said before, I'll explain why I went with Godot in an upcoming video. And after watching it, I think most of you will agree that that is the best choice moving forward. The other thing this change means for me is that I am starting to work on a few personal projects that will hopefully start getting published in the coming year, which means more devlogs and more game mechanic tutorial ideas. So I hope you find this exciting and not disappointing. Content is still going to be produced on this channel, just the nature of that content will be slowly transitioning over the next year. Okay, this video actually took longer than I had intended. I hope everyone is staying safe. This is the last time I will talk to you in 2020. Have a happy new year wherever you are in the universe. That is it for me. Thanks for watching and game on.